Here's how you can make a homemade traditional shawarma. What's better, homemade shawarma or the ones you get at the restaurants? Whichever is made with love. <laughs> it depends. Which staff member is making your food? If he doesn't love his life, you will not love Zaref. Mix boneless chicken legs with olive oil, lemon juice and zest, dried fenugreek leaves, cinnamon, ginger, coriander, paprika, nutmeg, thyme, cardamom and salt. Marinate this overnight, then grab a hot skillet. First, we start off with the marinated chicken. Cook on medium-high heat for about 15 minutes, making sure both sides are brown. We're now baking the sage bread over the flat top. If you don't have sage bread, you can try pita. Make little shawarma slices. You cook this perfectly, my friend. We got the sage bread. I know you love to call it the hard burn, but I call it the nice burn. <laughs> I think that's too much garlic sauce. <laughs> you can I, have too much garlic sauce. I okay. can take a little bit out. No, I guess my friend, I know the proper mathematics. The juicy chicken. Put you a little bit more, you know, because you're a little skinny. Next Next I get the fresh fries. Next I got the bacon. Just like that. Oh, can never have too much pickles, my friend. My favorite bar, the pomegranate molasses. Sweet, bitter, flavorful. Oh, my friend. That's part. So we're going to fold in the ends like this, and then we're going to go in like that. And remember, my friends, if it's not tight, it's not right. <laughs> Toast this on a hot skillet and even spread on some of the resting chicken juice. This is an 8.8 .8 out of 10. You gave me 9.6 in the restaurant. The best in the West. Shuhala.